Hi there, everybody. Good Friday morning to meteorologist Travis Klineski here. You made it to the end of the week, and we have a nice treat in store. Now, this morning, it's already a whole lot warmer than what we had out there yesterday morning. Some places are almost 40 degrees warmer than at this time yesterday. It's still a little chilly out there, but 20s and 30s, maybe even a few 40s out there. That's a pretty good start to our day with clear to partly cloudy skies out there. We'll see a few clouds from time to time, but average out mostly sunny today. Anywhere from the cooler 40s to the east and northeast to the warm 70s in the southwest 50s and 60s in between with the 60s more likely in areas that have little to no snow on the ground so just warmer and warmer the farther southwest you go which i'll show you in a bit tonight chilly with 30s for overnight lows maybe a few low 40s mostly clear skies and then tomorrow we're gonna warm it up even more mostly sunny a bit breezy with those west and northwest winds which will really help to boost those temps up into the 50s 60s and 70s across the state of nebraska again warmest to the southwest and coldest to the northeast so pretty good start to our weekend we will melt off a lot of snow now temps today again uh, keep in mind temperatures where there's snow on the ground it can be very tough to forecast for it's tough to say just how much that snow will impact temperatures but again the heavier snows on or at least more snow on the ground is around the tri-cities from there to broken bow towards the lincoln area now i'm going with temperatures in the 50s today up north 59 in lexington 72 mccook and Imperial 68 there for Beaver City. A range of uh, 50 to 72 in the south, so coolest around the Aurora area. They still have a lot of snow on the ground. 72 with no snow on the ground down towards Plainville, Kansas. And to the east, temperatures mid to upper 40s, lower 50s for the Nebraska counties there. Upper 50s down towards Belleville, Kansas. So definitely a difference, especially where there is snow on the ground, places like Lincoln and York. As for your temperatures the next couple of days, it gets better over the weekend. We will continue to melt snow, especially with that west wind. Um, being as breezy as it is, that snow will melt quickly with the sunshine and then uh, with the winds, the, the moisture will evaporate. So fog may not be too much of a concern this weekend with a westerly wind. We'll wait and see on that one. Next week, still looks okay, although cooler on Monday, 56, 59 on Tuesday. Then we do drop off quite a bit for Wednesday and Thursday, a shot of colder air coming in. Just how cold, that still remains to be seen. We could be potentially talking about colder temperatures than what I have on this graphic here. But still, doesn't look like a uh, an Arctic air mass, at least not for us here in Nebraska. That may not be the case farther east over in the uh, Great Lakes region of the United States. So for us again, it's really no complaints forecast. We will melt off a lot of snow the next couple of days. So hopefully at night those temps stay above freezing so we don't have a lot of icy conditions. But uh, you know, really the weather looks very nice over the next couple of days. And if you are a big snow fan, go out and enjoy it while you can because a lot of it will be gone by the time we get towards early next week. So there's your forecast for today. Until next time, I'm meteorologist Travis Klineski. I hope you have a great weekend.